So this is a video idea I came up with a few months back when, like before any Christmas Eve, before Halloween, and I just wanted to, instead of just posting images of my decorated room at Christmas, um, I wanted to do a video this year. So right now, these are all the areas that are gonna get covered with Christmas decorations. There's my bed, and then this is there's a ton of pop figures here, as you can see, and. Those are going to be used in the decoration stuff, so is that. Oops. Here's what I did first, I placed on a ton of cotton wool, and then I removed, I removed this, this is pre-recorded stuff, and then I replaced it with the Christmas Mickey, because that was just something I got cheap in a, a store nearby. But yeah, this footage was recorded in the last few days of November, because because of all the stuff I put up, it takes a few days to actually get it all up. Because I don't just spend the whole day doing it, and even if I did, I wouldn't get everything done. So the last week to a few days of November, last few days of November, are just spent putting all this stuff up. I've been doing. There's the first one. There's Captain America Snowman, and then there's more wool up here too. Eventually, I put tinsel up here. There's some reindeers up there too. I just start small by putting all the wool down. There's still all these ones left too, but here's the tree. I put the lights on with it first as well. There's a little star I put up. It's not great, but it's one I've always used. I don't know why I did that. <laughs> I think I just moved it actually. Yeah, I recorded this about three weeks ago nearly. But without the bulb light on, there's all the little lights around the stitch picture and on the universal shelf there I've all that on. So there's the tree and that's where I put it now. I used to put it on the bookshelf before. Here's the tree with tinsel on it. Like, lots of different small pieces of tinsel, so it's colourful. All the lights. And there's this shelf, the Disney-ish shelf with tinsel around it. Here's some smaller decorations around, well, big decorations at the bottom. And here's the first set of decorations I actually put on the tree. I put some more on and, like, show this later, but yeah, here's the, um, basic decorated tree. There's not as many decorations on right now, but I put more on after because I use some of the decorations that are bigger, like the ones at the bottom, to decorate other parts of my room. Like this house, the bear, the Santa and that um, form box are decorations, but if they fell, if the tree gets knocked over, because my cats have done that a lot, but nearly pushed it over since I put it up, so, there's a reason I put those ones there, because I had a reindeer one a few years ago that broke. There's Tootsie now, just destroying a bag. And here's this bit fully decorated, uh, nearly. There's all the wool down, there's more bigger decorations like that Eeyore there in the book. There's a figure of Crackshot, Mr. Hanky. There's Spongebob and Patrick, which I got those a few years ago and was happy to get. There's some sledding children there. There's a few more things on the tree as well, you'll notice. Like that snowman's actual candy cane I bought last year and I forgot I had it. And then there's just a few more things up there. And then there's some Santas and stuff around here. Also, this was just a way for me to... Because I got a new phone, like, uh, around the start of October. Because I have my uni lawn to thank for that. And I'm just testing its camera, and I think the camera quality on this is way better than the iPhone uh, 6s I had. But yeah. I think there's music playing in the background, but yeah, I've added a few extra things that when... Mm, my mum was giving me some other things that she didn't need for downstairs when she'd completed it. So I just... Well, I put some extra things down. There might be a few more things on the tree, but I just wanted to fully show it all again. All the lights there. I had the hat on the bulb, but I took that off later so it didn't burn. There is some stuff in the corner there which I didn't know what to put there, but this is the um, bookshelf bit. There's all this snow and stuff on here of all my snowmen, different kinds of snowmen I have. There's a Shrek there. Uh, there's a Rudolph up there. I might have changed a bit of this, but I just wanted to cover it as, again as well. I, yeah, I switched the reindeers around up there and added another one. There is just that tinsel there. 
And then there is this bit down here, which there's an Enderman figure there, which I ordered, which I like. There's a llama, which is a Christmas display, not Christmas store, but there is my nativity scene here, which I, I add more to it each year. As you can see, there's a lot of um, interesting characters here that were definitely there in the birth of Christ. Then down here, we've got some uh, Christmas DVDs, which there's a lot more we have, but these are the main ones I'd pick. Well, not really, but just that I saw. Then around the room, you'll see I put tinsel everywhere else. There's a nice little painting here too, that lights up when I turn it on. Some tinsel there. There's a snob, no not a snowman, a big penguin there, which is a container actually. There's a Christmas screw, I didn't really know what to, else to put down there, but there's lights on there. And there's Tootsie again, cleaning herself. Just she was watching us in this and on the TV because I decorated that with tinsel and there's a Santa up there too. I've got Shrek's Yule Log playing because it's not a complete Christmas without Shrek the Halls. Uh, but yeah, there is mainly just tinsel around this. Like one or two strips of tinsel have fallen off since because of the heat in my room. It's quite warm and it just fell off so I was like yeah I'm not putting it back up because it kept falling down. There's my Crash Christmas sweater and my decorated, well not decorated bed but I bought some new bed covering. There's a um, stocking there which I found. There's another stocking there which I had when I was younger and there's just some spare stuff there and yeah that's mostly it. I'm, I actually really like what I did this year. I might do it again next year, like, because I try to do more, because this is the most I've ever done. I've been decorating my room, like, where I actually cared. So I'll just focus on this, but I've been decorating my room, like, and put more care into it each year since maybe 2016 or 17, because I on my Instagram that I don't use anymore, there's images of me putting my tree up. Which I started doing then, but this year I wanted to do more than just that because I wanted to put videos up where you could just see everything. <laughs> and yeah, I think this is, I don't know, I asked a few of my friends and they said they'd watch this if I put it up, and it's not too long of a video, so yeah. I have actually put a few more things up since, that's terrifying, but eh, it's not too much. So yeah, let me know what you thought about that, if you enjoyed it. Like, I know a lot of people don't really do this much at Christmas when decorating, when I just transform my entire room, but eh, it's something I like to do every year, and maybe next year I'll probably do something similar to this, as I will try and do better next year maybe. And uh, maybe I could video myself putting stuff on the tree this time rather than just stages, but that might be a bit of a long video, I don't know. But yeah, um, thanks for watching, and if you do want to see me do this again next year or something similar, then uh, just say in the comments if you enjoy or just like and stuff, you know, that basic thing. But yeah, thank you, uh, bye.